Hello everybody, Zenokami here from Essence of Zen to bring you a let's play of South Park The Stick of Truth. Now, for anyone who's new to the channel, uh, I am not a core let's player. Uh, the channel itself is mainly a hobby channel for everything that uh, myself, uh, Louis, and any of the other members of the Essence of Zen team uh, does in terms of their hobbies and their interests. Also, if you hear a baby in the background, I'm so sorry. That's my niece. Uh, she seems to be a little rowdy today. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, what was I? So, usually, I, I wasn't planning to do a Let's Play of this, but um, I find South Park extremely interesting. I'm a big fan of the series. Uh, it's very raunchy. It's, it's very jokative. Uh, they cross so many lines. Uh, so, first and foremost, let me just say... If you are like underage or you know you feel uncomfortable with some of the things that may be depicted in this uh, game, such as the, the anal probing, the abortions, all that jazz, uh, this this series is not for you. Um, it, uh, the demographic for this channel is usually people around the age of 24 to 25. You know their belief systems differ greatly but for myself I am not bothered by it uh, I'm not gonna go into politics about you know pro-life over pro-choice and all that jazz um, if you are uncomfortable with all those images and you want to see a let's play of this game with a lot of things edited out then I highly recommend going to the channel of Nukem Dukem who's doing a let's play of this game without the uh, raunchy content the, the, run, the, the negative stuff so without further ado, uh, let me jump into this game. I will not speak during the cutscenes. Uh, remember that uh, I am not a let's player at heart. So, you know, yeah. So let's go ahead and get the new game started and I'll let you watch this awesome cutscene. In which case, uh, try to pick out because there's a racist joke right when Carmen, <laughs> yeah. I, I ran this once to test it, so, yeah. Deep in the lands of Zaran, the humans of Koopa Keep struggle to stay alive as they are attacked by the wicked drow elves of Larnia. Darkness falls as the humans beg their king to save them, a noble king known only as the Grand Wizard. <laughs> For a thousand years, the battle has been waged, with only the bravery of the Grand Wizard to protect his human followers. But even though the Wizard King is so undeniably cool, the Drow Elf armies continue their attacks. They seek the human's most treasured relic, the Stick of Truth. But the tides of war are soon to change, as news of a new kid spreads throughout the land. In order to save the humans, the Grand Wizard must get to the new kid, before the Drow Elves can manipulate his man and use him to take the sacred relic from human hands. For whomever controls the stick, controls the universe. So the audio seemed a little bit of out of sync. I'm not sure if that's, um, you know, uh, an initial bug in the game itself and that'll be patched later or what. So yeah, let's go ahead and I have my controller connected. I wanted to play with a controller, but if I have to do the... My goodness, my niece. If I have to do the mouse and keyboard, I'm going to do that as well. So, um, I am a black person, so I'm going to do a black character. <laughs> I'm actually a little lighter than this. I'm, I'm more of a, of a darker shade of caramel with like a, a, a tint of red in it. But whatever. So we're gonna go over. Um, I have dreadlocks, but very rarely do you see a, a game with customer uh, with custom graphics that let you have dreadlocks. So let's see. Nope. Nope. So we're gonna go with braids instead, because I used to have braids when I was a kid. So, uh, oh, what about, no, nah, that's not gonna work, okay, uh, 
where to go. So we're gonna go ahead and go with this uh, secondary. We'll go with the blue for the rubber bands. Uh, one moment. All right, sorry about that. Wanted to make sure everything was okay. Uh, so we're gonna go with the uh, black braids with uh, blue rubber bands. My hair is actually a really, really dark shade of brown, but there's not one here that closely matches that shade of brown. And I used to wear the black rubber band tips, but whatever. It's like an outfit. I want to go back. Hold on, I'm gonna go back real quick. See, I'm noticing there wasn't a choice for um, gender. But whatever. Um, I might roll with this outfit unless I find one a little bit better. I like skulls. Uh, I'm not like a, a goth or emo kid or anything in that nature, but skulls are awesome. I mean, <laughs> yeah. Uh, let's go with the white shirt with. Oh, okay. I can't change the color of the skull. White pants. No, no, that's. Uh uh. Uh. How does this one differ? Isn't this the exact same as... I guess the... Oh, the sleeves are different. Okay, I can work with that. Blue jeans, maybe. Let's go with blue jeans. Uh, have them look more denim. Okay, okay. Okay. Okay, my name is Mr. Oh, what is his name? I forgot already. Because I always confuse him with, um, not in terms of person, but name wise. There's Mr. Hanky, the Christmas Pooh. And then there's. Oh, I forget his name, the counselor. Uh, so, anyway, we got our outfit. Let's go next. Uh, should I have a butt chin? Let me get a, a nice manly butt chin. I'm not really keeping the butt chin or the double chin. I'm not doing a double chin. I don't have freckles. I don't know if that's gonna be like mud or a birthmark. Now I do have a scar under my left eye, but it's, it's more so like a like a, a one piece Luffy scar type ordeal. It, it's very faint, but you can't see it. So, uh, well, you can't see it anymore. I got, well, I had an accident where a stick got, you know, uh, basically stabbed right underneath my eye and it left a very nice mark so but, no, whatever uh, I do wear glasses but I also wear contacts from time to time my glasses now are square frames and they're stainless steel Okay, one actually has lens and, uh, lenses, lenses, blah, blah, blah. tongue twister. Uh, so we'll go with this one with our stainless, and it, it, it looks more uh, hipsterish. Isn't it like a darker? I guess we'll go with this one. Secondary. That works, I guess. Uh, yes. I still want to know if I can play with my controller or not, though. Plot. Got something on my screen. I hope it's not a dead pixel.
Well, I think that's everything. We did it, hun. We're really moved in. It's a new beginning for us. Things are finally going to be good. Do you really think it will be better for him? They won't look for him here. We just need to make sure he doesn't attract any attention. Come on, let's see how he's doing. Typical Sweetie, South Park. <laughs> hun, you all dressed? Hey, champ. How do you like your new room? I hate it. I know it's a big change for all of us, but, son, do you remember why we moved to this quiet little mountain town? He doesn't remember. He doesn't remember at all. That's good. That's good. He doesn't remember. Uh, sweetie, we want you to have lots of fun here. Why don't you go out and make some friends? Right. Get outside and play, son. Like, like normal kids. Am I like an alien? We've got some money for you on the kitchen counter, sweetie. Just be back before it gets dark. Uh huh. Yeah, we love you too. <laughs> okay. So, options. I'm getting about 30 frames per second right now. I have this in full um, resolution. So I'm going to see how that plays uh, after this episode is done. It's going to be increments of about 20, 30 minutes long per episode. I'm not seeing any gameplay delay, but uh, once I get the first episode done, I'm going to look at it and actually see how it plays in a, in a media file. So, because when you upload to YouTube, the quality drops and some frames are like, eh, it gets, it gets set to about 30 anyway, regardless. So, we'll see. But I wanna know if I can... Controls, no controls? Subtitles and voice, difficulty no. I, I guess I can't play with uh, my controller. Oh well. No biggie in my case. Except this is gonna turn on my PS3. I'm gonna just leave that alone then. Create a new save game. Can I not save yet? Progress since your last checkpoint would not be saved. Do you wish to create a copy of your most recent checkpoint? No. I guess I can't save just yet. Unless it's saving everything now. Um, so now I did... Uh, I did uh, watch Nukem Dukem play the intro part. And I did learn a few things. Um, f what can I say? Uh, first hand anything that has a golden type of handle you can usually interact with it So I can actually store things here awesome put items in the storage if you don't want to carry them or sell them Double click an item to the inventory left mouse button and it will be placed in your storage double click an item in storage And it will be moved back to your inventory Okay Okay, so Take all. I like I, I like the animation. Do, 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 do. Um, let's see. Alrighty, see how this doorknob is golden, but it's locked. So this bathroom, an old sponge and a rusty pipe. Can I close it? And if you notice, there's a little sign here that says the door and this arrow pointing down here. A lot of people actually said they tend to to not notice this. I don't I don't really know why, but okay. And there is indeed a mini game for pooping. Oh, I did not expect that. <laughs> nothing, is, nothing is seriously wrong with with, 
with these makers, man. I, I, I swear. Okay, let's go downstairs. I can actually walk on each step. Okay, did see this door handle isn't golden, so I get no interaction at all. So I'm gonna go in here, open up this and forks, all that jazz. Just uh, take my money and talk to my mom. Hey, mom. Go on outside, sweetie. Go look around the neighborhood. Okay. Come on, son. Get out there. Make friends. Okay. It wasn't a request. It was a command. Now get out there and make some friends. Okay. Jeez. Uh, I was about to say. I forget. J. Huh. Go outside and make some friends. I got a map. The inventory. Nice. Cool. Dies. Back. Hmm. Throw the to at your enemy. Oh wow, that's okay. Is there another way to open? Search things back here. Okay, ladders. Okay. So far, so good. UPS. You shall die by my warhammer, Drow Elf! Uh-uh! I banish thee to the forest realm! That way, I banish you first! Haha! <laughs> you can't hold out much longer! Help! Somebody! I can't hold out much longer! Hey, no fair! That's <laughs> cheating! I'm gonna tell my mom! Thanks, kid! I didn't realize he had a health potion! My name is Butters the Merciful! I'm a paladin! I live right next door to you! We should be friends! Okay... I have one new friend. You've just made your first friend in South Park. Message your friends. Will, uh, message from your friends will show up here on your homepage. To see all the friends you've made, click on the collectible tabs. Alrighty. There's a new kid playing with us, and me and him are friends. Uh, that was n that way. Nobody picks on him. Oh, uh, butters. Chimpoko oh, Chimpokomans. I remember them. They're from the, uh... Now that we're friends, you should speak with the Wizard King. He's been talking about your arrival. The wizard lives this way, in the greenhouse, over there. Okay. These are Chimpokomans. Uh, it was an episode... It's, it's basically, uh, making fun of Pokemon. But, yeah. Hey, where are you from? Georgia. Where'd you live before moving here? Georgia. You like Colorado? Eh. Why are you wearing your hair like that? Oh, hail the Grand Wizard! <laughs> so, you are the new kid. Your coming was foretold by Coldwell Banker. I am the Wizard King. But the time for talk is not now. Let me show you my kingdom. Check your inventory often. Forgetting to equip newer and better weapons can leave you at a disadvantage in combat. So if you haven't, if you don't know, um, the joke, okay. The joke about Cartman being called the Grand Wizard is a KKK reference, which is why I laughed. Oh, who's your new friend, Eric? Oh. Shut up, Mom. Not now. Cartman's around. Evil Cartman's gold <laughs> Oh, come on, Game Sphere. Oh, Two dollars. Inventory. Uh, 
Mustaches. Yeah. Let's go T. We'll go with that. Hello there, children. <laughs> Don't talk to her, she's not part of the game. She's obviously part of the game. She's on her phone anyway, I'm saving electricity. Cheesy poofs and snacky cakes can heal your lost HP in battle. Remember, you can use an item, including a healing item, and still attack or use an ability in the same turn. Welcome to the kingdom of <laughs> Koopa Keep. <laughs> Our weapon shop here is tended by Clyde, a level 14 warrior. Here you can see our massive stables, overseen by the level 9 ranger, Scott Malkinson, who has the power of diabetes. <laughs> and here, of course, is the breathtaking and lovely Princess Kinney, the fairest maiden in all the kingdom. Don't ask why Kinney wanted to be a chick, it's just how he seems to be rolling right now. <laughs> See, I'm still a little bit, like, rock of insanity. Top the cart, man. Be careful, the Rock of Insanity holds mysterious, mysterious powers. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Full of vision. So I'm still kind of like weirded out because you couldn't pick a uh, your own gender for the game. And I actually know a lot of women who wants to play this game as their own persona, so that might be a little irritating for them. I got a daffle deal. I still cannot save. Why can I not save? Alright guys, I'm going to end the first episode here and then test some things out. So I'll be right back.